Hello yeah. everyone. Uh, th in this video, I will show you how to back up and restore an R AWS Aurora RDS PostgreSQL database using AWS Backup. Let's get started. First, you can see there is a database and it has an instance. But another database uh, will use the AWS Backup to uh, create a backup of this database. A backup will be stored in the vault, so we choose this vault. One is in the click here to create its backup. And we need to decide uh, which cluster it will be used. And as you can see, there we can select the period of this backup. So let's create it. And uh, after you click the create, you can see your backup is created. And uh, it's waiting for. After it complete, we can see our backup is in the default default, which is the first one. So we can use it to restore. Here we enter the cluster name for our restored. And uh, I will call it restore sample one. And other settings we are keeping the default settings. We can see the file here. The file here is a pending data, and it will be the creating or running something like that, and then complete. It is based on your uh, database size. So we use a small database, so it creates quickly, and. Uh, we can see the status is complete now. But if we look now back to the RDS, you can see there is only a cluster which name store sample one and with no instance. So we need to manually create the instance for our cluster. was copied from the AWS tutorial and then I will paste it uh, to the to below. So basically we identify the uh, restore instance name and the instance class, the engine which one we need to use and the type. So after it in the script you can see our instance is now created and just waiting for it and it's available now so this is the way you um, create the instance from a restored cluster thank you very much